So hello and welcome back to Geek Panda Tech. Today we have the Forvella S20 on camera microphone by Small Rig. And there's a bit of a picture of it on the front there. So it comes with all the, the uh, attachments to the hot shoe, the rabbit's foot, and the clip-on microphone that all plugs in and then plugs into the main bit of the camera. So that's the front of the box, side of the box, not much. And on the back, we have uh, what's in the box. So we've got the actual microphone, the clip-on mic, storage pouch, foam windscreen, foam windscreen again for the other mic, the furry windscreen on camera mic, shock mount, 3.5mm cable and another 3.5mm cable depending on what you're going to be plugging it into, a customized sticker set and the user manual. So without a further ado, let's get into the box. Off. and we're met by the storage pouch straight away unfortunately it's all it's all plastic no cardboard so maybe next time and inside there we have our manuals and our sticker set <laughs> that's quite cute shall we put in those somewhere then we have the main event the actual microphone itself it's quite it's quite hard and crunchy. Microphone with its mount. So we'll pop that back on. There we go. And here we have the foam cover for both of the mics. A different kind of foam cover there. An actual foam rather than the rabbit foot type. Ah, there's already one on there, so that's a nice little spare one. It looks like there's a Quite a good amount of cable on there that's just uh, and I like these these velcro cable ties they're really cool really useful oh, okay so that just keeps going I reckon there's a good meter and a uh, meter and a half two meters on that connection there so offers you quite a lot and then this one's just got a little bit of flex onto it so that's pretty much everything out of the box I will be back very shortly with these attached to the microphone or the camera even. And here we are back. So hopefully now you should be getting some sound through the main microphone itself. I have left the rabbit foots off, but I have put the foam filter on. So any plosives like my P's and my B's should hopefully be a little bit softened. I am sitting pretty much directly behind the microphone. So yeah, hopefully that's a good test of how much better this will be than the onboard microphone on the Sony A7 IV. So in just one second, I'm gonna change over to the clip-on microphone just here. But before I do that, I did forget to mention that this black cable, the little spring on it is actually for the phone, which is labeled just there. So there we go. So just one second and I'll be back and put this clip microphone on. Explain that a little bit more. So you should be hearing my voice now with the clip on microphone. And just to demonstrate the couple of different ways you can have this set up. So I just have this on the camera like this, and this is your output and that's your input for the clip on microphone if you so want to have that. So hopefully the audio has come through okay. And you've just got a little switch on the top here for stereo or mono sound so that's quite nice as well and just to attach it you, you just pop it on and you just twist this down to tighten against your hot shoe mount or alternatively there is a thread there where you can attach it into if you've got a a cage around your camera or you want it set up slightly somewhere else to get that slightly better sound quality so we just flip back to this one and uh, yeah just finally I'm hoping this video has somewhat helped you in being able to hear the difference between the on-camera microphone or the internal camera microphone hopefully you've seen a couple of other videos and see how this compares small rig are a great brand um, I'm not being sponsored by them but their their cages that I've used in the past have been brilliant and um, yeah, hopefully this audio is good that I can um, 
carry on using this on future videos. So a final word from me, thank you for watching the video. I hope you all guys are all staying safe. If you liked the video, please give it a like and a thumbs up. And if you could subscribe, that would be brilliant. And if you have any comments, please leave them down below and I'll answer them as best I can. Thank you.